today we are going to test some glues here and I watched some videos online some youtubers they test the filament strength I have the polymax I printed out with the polymax filament and then people try to use different kind of glue to glue them together and some of the glues I can find them in China that's why I went online and did some research to find which one is the most common and international so that you guys can find it in your country too so I've got the Loctite 411 uh, same brand Loctite 454 Loctite 401 and Loctite 435 I don't know what those numbers mean that's why we're going to test it out but they're all CA glue and we've got the UHU glue here uh, you can I think you can easily find it in Eula and Asia but I'm not sure about in America and at last we have the hot glue here hot glue everyone it's easy to find it for everybody so I'm going to test all these glues with the polymax filament as far as I know it is the strongest PLA filament I know there are filaments that are a bit stronger but it's more difficult to print and I think the Polymax is a good balance between the filament strength and the ease of printing so let's test it out and let me put on the mask first oh, I'm going to put a mask not just for the safety issues but also it's very cold outside I don't want to open the windows I know you guys are going to make fun of me since you're going to make fun of me then um, of course I'm going to put it on I forget my gloves So it has been, uh, I have waited overnight and I dig up my scale. It was used, um, but it was cheap and I got it. And it goes up, the maximum weight for it is 5 kilo. And for uh, the Polymax, a lot of people already tested the strength. They know it is strong, but for me, I'm just going to test the uh, glue, how strong the glue is, and I'm going to uh, run it down to the nearest quarter of kilogram so now let's put it in the vise this is the hot glue this is the hot glue one the first one we are going to test is the hot glue Oh, 
that is super weak. That is like point two point two five. So the filament broke before the glue, but I only printed uh, the infill is only 10%. I don't know if I print it stronger, what would happen, but right now I'm just going to write down the number. So 435 is 2 kilo. Now let's tr uh, test the 401. Same thing, it's the Loctite glue. It is 1.25 and this time the filament didn't break, it just come off so I guess this screw is not as strong as the uh, 435. So 401 is 1.25 and now let's test the 454. The 454 is only um, 0.25, it's very weak. So you might notice that I use small pieces of plastic and small amount of glue to test the strength. I don't want to work with something large and heavy weight, it might be dangerous for me. But I still think the result will be pretty accurate. So let's test out the sheer strength of the glue. Point seven five. So the PLA brace that is um two point seven five for the four five four. Now let's test the strongest four three five. See if that's really the strongest. Um, also the plastic brace. A lot of people say CA gel is the strongest, but it turns out the 435, Loctite 435 is stronger than the 454. Maybe if for other countries it will be different, I don't know. And the UHU is not um, right for this application, hot glue, great stuff, but also not for this. So. I'm going to use the 435 for my project and again I have to fans Polymaker to send me the Polymax to uh, test out uh, the only reason the PLA break because it printed at 10% usually when I printed 20 to 30% it never breaks like that because this time I printed it at 10% that's why it breaks but in general the Polymax is super strong and really easy to print that's all. I'm going to work on my project. Remember, if I can do it, everyone can do it. Thanks a lot for watching.